What's going on, you guys? You got Coach Zoe here, and this is your glute bridge workout. We're going to do all variations of glute bridges in Tabata format. 20 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest, four rounds of each exercise, five exercises. We're going to get started holding a glute bridge. So set up. I want your feet about hip width apart, hands down at your sides, eyes on the ceiling in three, two, one. Let's go lift up those hips and just squeeze your bottom as you press those hips to the ceiling. Okay, rest. All right, so that was one round. We have four of those, right? That's two minutes of work, and then we're going on to exercise number two. Let's begin. Hips up. starting to drop, squeeze your butt a little bit more. Let's go last round. Hips high, squeeze, make sure you're getting that nice extension through the lumbar. Push down through your heels. And rest. Woo! Oh my goodness. Okay. Nice. We're going to pulse it up. So we'll be right back to where we are. Just dipping up and down. Let's go. Pulses. So I'm not touching my butt to the floor, right? Just giving myself a few inches up, a few inches down. At the top, block it out. Really squeeze your glutes. And rest. Oh my goodness. I got my knees into my chest. I got my booty a little bit. Three, two, one. Plant and pulse. Let's go. under tension. Oh my goodness. We'll alternate sides. And rest. Oh my gosh, like, I don't even know if I can finish this. This is so tough. My legs, my glutes are screaming. All right, other leg in the air. Let's go. I'm just kidding. You think I'm going to quit on you? I also 
also like to stabilize my foot up in the air. That way I'm not trying to kick it, right? Yes. Woo! All right, we have one more on each side. Again, bend your knees, pull them in your chest if you need that little rest. All right, let's go back to that first leg. This one, you can go all the way up and down. also even cross like this. Not my favorite though. I feel like you tend to kind of push against that leg. Right? I feel like this makes it a little more challenging because you have that off balance, so kind of twisting weight you have to play against. You have to stabilize. And rest. Woo! We got two more exercises to go. If your booty's not screaming, you're not doing it right. <laughs> All right, hands behind your hips, feet on front. We have a reverse table glute bridge. So same thing, we're hip thrusting, right? But we're using those hands to give us more range of motion. Again, at the top, really squeeze as hard as you can rest. Woo! On fire! Someone plays that. Play that Alicia Keys song. <laughs> you want to drop those hips down directly beneath. Rest. Right. If at the top you're lowering down towards your heels, uh -uh -uh, don't do it. Starting again in three, two, one, let's go. And rest. Woo! Oh my goodness. We have one more of these, and then we're going on to the hardest variation yet. Let's get started. I should have started with the hardest and worked down. But Coach Zoe does not work that way. I want a challenge, and I'm gonna give it to you. And rest. Okay, quick shake out. Finishing off with a reverse plank glute bridge. So we're gonna have those hands back behind us again. This time, point the toes, lift up, keeping the legs straight. Boom. Try not to lock out your knees. If you feel like that's happening, make sure that you're pointing the toes. Because if you flex your feet, it kind of makes you extend those knees even more. Rest. So I'm pointing my nose, I'm <laughs> pointing my toes on purpose to protect my knees. So that was our first round. Get ready for round number two. And then we're done. This is our last exercise. Let's go. And rest. We got two rounds to go, ladies. Shake it out. Oh, my back even is getting that working. Let's go. Round three. Almost at the end. And rest. All right, you guys. Last round, best round, last round for the entire glute bridge workout. So get ready. Three, two, one, let's go. And 
and rest. That is it, you guys. Thank you for joining me. This was your quick 10-minute all-glute bridge workout. I will see you next time.